Konnichiwa and welcome everybody back to Chrono Reviews. This time it's time for another dinosaur collectible. And this time it's the Master Fossil series from Griffon Enterprises. Skeleton model series and this is the first installment. And it's the Velociraptor. Velociraptor have always been a favorite of mine. Ever since I was a kid. And I can't be alone about that because I know many people who love the raptor. And this is a fossil, a skeleton of the Velociraptor, and it's not the uh, Jurassic Park proportions, this is a realistic raptor. And the box is beautifully designed. And this artwork of the skeleton on all the sides. even on the top but not on the bottom and you can even open this window up the front and there is description here and some pictures you can hardly see the raptor inside though because it's a flat plastic wrap and everything you can like if you look carefully you can only see the protoceratops skull and some claws. And here we have the Velociraptor fossil opened up. And you need to attach the tail because it's a separate part. I've already done that, but do it carefully because the slim parts, I'm not sure how sturdy they are, so I don't want to put much, too much pressure on them. But you need to like hold here and press it on. Also, there are two pegs attaching the base to the other base, um, the display this display plate. And I must say, this is a very awesome kit. Um, I'm not usually reviewing fossils, so I don't exactly know what to compare to. But as far as my knowledge of dinosaurs goes, I was a dinosaur freak as a kid. This is pretty damn close to an actual raptor fossil. And of course it's, as I've said, the um, it's not Jurassic Park, it's an actual raptor. And uh, the paint job is slightly less as the box art shows, but it's still pretty good. It has some areas there is a little bit flat on the color but as a full picture it looks awesome I like the details on the skull although those ribs are bent a little bit backwards while on the box they are slightly more leaned forward however seeing as random and damaged real fossils can be I can live with that because it gives some realism to it, everything. I also love that they picked a Protoceratops skull, since all of those classic scenarios of Velociraptors attacking Protoceratops and the fossils they found with that. I actually do hope they release a full Protoceratops fossil to go with this. However, I haven't seen any more fossils released, except for this that says it's the number one in the series. They did release a T-Rex, but not a fossil. Let me show you all the way around. It's actually a little bit bigger than I expected. Which is also, in a way, it's a plus. Except for display space. And the tail go all the way up. I can, like, it's quite long. And there's some neat details. Let me show you up a little bit closer. The Protoceratops skull and everything is very well sculpted. You can see the details here. But what's the best is of course the raptor's skull itself. I really love that. There's also those details inside the skull. It's hard to see this down like. I'm uh, rearranging my apartment so there is. I don't have a dedicated review spot right now. Uh, 
There you can see the details inside, inside the skull. It's a little bit hard plastic, so it's. I'm not going to uh, risk because the parts are not that bendable. I don't want anything breaking, so I'm just giving a, a, a little tip that be careful with this 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 model, just in case. And the base itself looks like it's made of wood. I'm not sure if it's actual wood, but it looks really nice. And there's this metal plating saying Velociraptor. I'm not sure how... Uh, what scale it's supposed to be, but... It's not scaled. At least the, not, the box doesn't say anything about that. However, you can compare it to the Rebor Velociraptor in case you want a little bit of its size. And actually, it's pretty big. But it's a very, very nice piece of collection. And. Uh, It will look awesome in my display case. Or together with my Jurassic Park movies and everything. I rearrange my displays pretty often. Like this one is placed together with my old special edition VHS from Jurassic Park. I like nostalgia collectibles as well. But it will look very very good. And I can actually very much recommend this. They did a good job on this fossil and I actually I, I hope they release many many more. I would not buy everyone since uh, of display space and everything I can't fill up with everything but I'd like to buy more of my favorite dinosaurs and display like this one. The raptor is always a child favorite. The T-Rex in all its brutal honor, but the raptor always stayed on top for me. My brother always liked the T-Rex more, and I liked the raptor more, so I always had fights over which one was the better dinosaur. I do like the T-Rex though, so that was just some childish things. But if you like dinosaurs, and if you like fossil models, I highly recommend this. It's probably the best I've seen of a raptor. I'm not sure if there are many other options either. But Griffin Enterprises, they did a good job on this one. And I highly recommend it. So until next time, take care and sayonara.